highly considering changing my name to chat gpt robbie no i'm just kidding but in this video i'm teaching you multiple ways that you can use chat gpt to make some money okay it's robbie cornelius with web asset group the number one platform that's teaching you how to master your mind and make money online and if you are looking for some ways to make money with chat gpt let's get right in to it okay so first of all we got to go to chat gpt and we're not even going to play around with this at all we're not playing around with this at all go ahead and upgrade your account to chat gpt4 it boggles my mind the amount of people that ask is it worth it paying chat for uh chat gpt4 it's 20 dollars 20 it costs you what how much it costs you twenty dollars if you know you're questioning twenty dollars that's the first thing you got to get your mind right you got to get your mind set on abundance it's twenty dollars if you can't afford to to, to invest twenty dollars into a software that's literally going to change your life your life probably doesn't even deserve to be changed let's be honest with it okay so go ahead upgrade to chat gpt4 it's going to give you more features i shouldn't even have to say that but I'm just gonna talk about some ways that you can use chat GPT to make some money. The first thing you can use chat GPT for is you can use chat GPT to come up with an idea that can make you some money. Okay. The first thing you can do, you can say, Hey, chat GPT. Hey, chat GPT. I'm looking to make some money online. Can you help me out? Can you give me a couple of ideas? I'm, I love talking about yoga. I love talking about fitness. I love talking about health overall. Maybe we can build some ideas around that. What do you think? And then that's all I'm going to do. By the way, if you want to talk to chat GPT, I have a um, Chrome extension that I'm using right now. It's right up here at the top. It's called YouTube. Not that one. Hold on. Let me. It's called uh, da da da. Where is it? Where's the Where's the YouTube? Maybe I'm not using that one anymore. Maybe. Oh, right here. It's called Voice Control for Chat GPT. That's what I'm using. It's a free Chrome extension. So here it is. Online yoga classes. Start an online platform or use platforms like Zoom, Teachable, or Udemy to offer yoga classes. You can offer live sessions, pre-recorded series, or even specialized courses for different levels or specific groups. Fitness and health blog. There you go. Ebooks and digital guidelines or digital guides, a YouTube channel, consultation services, subscription box, affiliate marketing, fitness app, merchandise, online workshops, you name it. But here's the deal. You got to pick one. You got to pick one. If you don't pick one, you're going to have what they call analysis paralysis. You're going to overthink this stuff, okay? So I want you to choose one. So let's just say you want to start uh, teaching people online classes, or let's just say for kicks and giggles, you want to start affiliate marketing. So now you understand that, okay, I can talk about yoga and maybe I can start a yoga blog and to make money off of that yoga blog. Maybe I can add some affiliate programs in there. Okay. So then I can ask chat GPT, Help me find some affiliate programs related to yoga. Now, this is where we're going to start. Certainly, affiliate programs. Okay, so here's some popular affiliate programs. Yoga Download, okay, whatever this is. Get, I need the links to these things. It's not giving me the links right now. Give me the links. Okay, Yoga Download. Let's, let's, let's just Google that. So I'm going to do um, Yoga Download Affiliate program yoga download affiliate program here we go yoga download affiliate program it says yoga download affiliate program earn extra income from your blog website or newsletter yoga download is the top resource for online yoga meditation pilates and fitness classes as well as music our classes are extremely popular and are com 
our company is growing. We offer 12% commission. That's what I'm looking for. 12% commission. 12% commission via our affiliate program and provide an array of beautiful eye-catching banners for your site. Simply sign up using the link below and then add one or more of our banners to your website and or newsletter to earn extra money. Okay, so boom. And you're going to click right here where it says share a sale. You're going to sign up on share a sale. So you want to click that and you have to be a member of share a sale. Okay. You have to be a member of share a sale in order to become a part of this affiliate program. But if yoga is not your niche, choose your niche. Okay. Choose your niche. And it's going to tell you where you need to go to sign up for that particular affiliate program. So pick your niche, okay? Pick your niche that you want to talk about and then go to Google and search for that niche plus affiliate program and then find affiliate program that resonates with you. And then what you're going to do is you're going to create content related to, and when I say content, I mean videos. You're going to create videos related to that particular niche, okay? You're going to create videos related to that particular niche and you're going to, I'll, that's step one. So step one is making a video related to that particular niche. That's it. And then once you make videos related to that particular niche, what you're going to do is you're also going to blog about that particular niche. You need a website. Okay. So one thing you could do to get a website, you can go to, mm, let's just say uh, Wix. So we'll do Wix.com, going over here to Wix, and you can just start building yourself a blog. Select right here where it says blog and then get started. And then I'm going to do my best to sign in here. One second. And then once you log in, you're going to hit create a new site. And then you're going to hit create on Wix editor, or you could try the new Wix studio, but I'm just going to do this. And you're going to select right here where it says blog. And then you're going to, oh, mindfulness blog. What about yoga? I wonder if they have one for yoga. Here's one right here, yoga blog. And then we're going to hit next. Hit next. And then I'm going to say Robbie's yoga blog. You want to give it a name that's based around a keyword that a lot of people are going to be searching for, okay? So then it says, what do you want to add to your website? You blog, we got a chat bot, we got an Instagram feed. Right now, I'm only going to focus on the blog right now. That's it. That's all I want right now. And then we're going to hit next. All right, start setting up this website. Begin with the template is what I'm going to choose. And I'm going to just choose this one right here. I'm going to edit this site. So that's all I'm going to do. Um, this is uploaded. This is, you know, doing its thing right now. And now what I'm going to do is, like I mentioned earlier, all we're going to do is we're going to create video content around the particular niche that we have decided to, uh, to target. And you want to start off with a YouTube channel or a TikTok page, okay? So TikTok or YouTube, because those platforms are going to give you the most, um, the most views, okay? And so what you want to do is start off with a, a, a YouTube page. Record a video about that particular niche. Shouts out to my man Sidney Tarver right there. What up, Sidney? Um, and all you got to do is record that content. And then... Once you record that content, don't worry about trying to make it. Look at my other videos. If you don't want to be on camera, look at my other videos. Look at this video right here on how to create faceless YouTube videos. If you don't want to be on video yourself, if you want to be on video, just simply get on video like I'm doing right here and just talk to the camera, educate people about what you know about that particular subject. If you don't know what to say, go back to chat GPT and you say to chat GPT, Write me an article about the importance of doing yoga in order to remain positive throughout the day. 
And this is going to start writing you an article right here. The power of yoga, staying positive and energized throughout the day in today's fast paced world is easy to get caught up in the whirlwind of tasks, responsibilities and distractions. The resulting stress can weigh heavily on our minds, leading to the feelings of negativity and exhaustion. However, there is a timeless practice that promises not only physical well-being, but also mental clarity and positivity. Yoga. Let's delve into how incorporating yoga into your daily routine can uplift our spirits and help us maintain a positive outlook throughout the day. Mind-body connection. At its core, yoga is about the union of the mind and body. As we move through various, what is that? Various, whatever that is, postures, we are encouraged to focus on our breath and be present in the moment. So you just read that script, okay? Read the script. That's all you got to do. Read the script and then give a call to action at the end of the video. Hey, if you want more, make sure you like, comment, subscribe and make sure you visit and then you tell people to visit your website. So after you record that video, I'm going to show you something else that you can do. You want to go and download a free Chrome extension called YouTube Summary with ChatGPT and Claude. YouTube Summary with ChatGPT and Claude. You're going to come to this page here and you all you're going to do is hit install on Chrome if you use Google Chrome. And if you have Safari, hit install on Safari. That's all you're going to do. Once you install that extension, you're going to open it up by clicking this little puzzle at the top of the right. And then you're just going to pin it. And then now what you're going to do is once you upload your video, any video that you can create that you create for your YouTube channel, with the click of a button, let's just say this video right here, with the click of a button, this software will now take your video and create a brand new blog article for you off of that video, okay? So you might be saying to yourself, why won't I just use the content that I've already created right here? Because when you get really, really good at creating YouTube videos, you want to start learning how to say things in your own voice. You don't want to just read the script. But if you read the script in your own voice, this software, all I got to do is click this button right here. I'll give you a prime example. Click this button right here. As you see, the Chrome extension is up here at the top right. I'm just going to click this button that says View AI Summary. I hit it, and it's going to open up ChatGPT right here. And watch it transcribed everything I said in the video. And now it's about to create me a brand new article from it. Watch this. I'm going to scroll down here and look at that. Unlock the secret of finding your gold mine niche. Hey there, digital pioneers. Ever felt lost in the vast world of online content creation? Struggled with the idea of narrowing down your focus? Well, Robbie Cornelius of the renowned Web Asset Group is here to spill the beans on the magic of finding your niche key takeaway. And then it's just going to take what I said in that video and it's going to create me more original content around what I already said in the video. Okay. Think about that. This is powerful. And then what you want to do, if you want to get really good with it, you can open up the Chrome extension, you know, just click on this little icon up here, open up that Chrome extension and go right here where it says prompt summary. And you want to select chat GPT for with plugins. And then you also want to go down here and give it your own unique prompt. When you give it your own unique prompt, that's going to make the output of that content that much better. And so what I've done in here is I've given it my own unique uh, prompt. OK, that's all I've done so that it, it, it is me instead of it just being A.I., it is me. So you don't want to just use AI to come up with content without it having your voice in it. You know what I mean? So you want to use AI, use ChatGPT to exploit your voice or to amplify your voice. You want to take what you originally sound like and create blog articles around that. And that's what this software allows me to do. And so, boom, there's my little article about it. And notice something powerful. I have links in this article. How did I do that? because I went to this summary and I put certain links in it. I told this, I told this um, prompt summary, I said, hey, include these links in my article. Include, you know, include Web Asset Group for more information that helps them master their mind. I said also include this link to my Square account. And so 
I included, I told the software to include that. And that's why you see these little blue icons right here, because these links are embedded in the text. Okay. And so that's an easy way. And all I had to do is then turn around and turn that into a blog article that I post on the website. And I have a team shouts out to Diana and all of the people that helped me with the content shouts out to my son, Cade, who are responsible for turning all of my YouTube content into amazing blog articles. I really appreciate my team. I wouldn't be able to do all of this without them. And so that's what I'm doing. Okay. And then that's how we're using chat GPT. And you might be saying, okay, well, what else, what else, Robbie, what else can I do? Okay. So we already created this powerful, um, article around. So we say we got this powerful article around yoga. All right. So now I'm going to go back to chat GPT and I'm going to create a new chat and I want to make sure that chat GPT four is selected with Dolly three. So now I'm going to tell it to create me high quality thumbnails related to yoga, make the images very vibrant and very detailed, make them very unique, make it to where people will stop and read these articles simply because the images look so amazing. And then I stop it just like that. And then the Dolly three icon is going to pop up, letting you know that chat GPT is creating me some amazing images right there on chat GPT. So I don't have to go to another software. All of this is taking place inside of chat GPT. And that's the most amazing thing because now I don't have to go all these other places. It's all taking place right here. So now I'm going to go back over here. I want to look at my yoga studio. Okay. This is my yoga studio uh, website that I was making with Wix right here. If you want a professional website and you want, you want someone to do it for you, then go visit my company that I own, my web design and marketing company called Southern Web Service. Okay, Southern Web Service, we build money-making websites for companies that want to grow. Look for the orange and black. If you don't want to build the website yourself, then reach out to my team. You can send a text message right here by clicking this little um, orange button in the right corner that says text us or email us or even call. And my team is going to help you out. They'll build the website for you. So don't worry. But if you want to build it yourself, you can go over here to Wix and start building it yourself. And, you know, you're just you're just beautifying it at that point. And so sometimes Wix can be easy for people and sometimes it can be hard for people. It just depends on your level of uh, your your level of knowledge and expertise when it comes to uh, creating creating stuff. OK, so then I'm going to go over here to where my blog is and I want to do where's the blog blog pages blog post and I want to click here and where is the actual blog section All right, post blog okay so we're gonna go there and basically you're gonna double click and then you should see the blog post comes up you create blog and you take your you take your article that you've created around yoga. Where is that article at for me? That article around yoga. Boom. So take this article around yoga. Where's the yoga at? Where's that yoga article that I had earlier? Maybe I need to refresh chat GPT in order to get that discover your niche online ideas for yoga. Okay, here it is right here. So I'm going to take that article that I thought about for yoga uh, that chat GPT created for me related to yoga. Okay. And then where is there? And then all I'm going to do is just copy and paste my blog there. I'm going to create spaces between the blog so it doesn't look like a cluttered piece of crap. And you want to do some keyword research. You want to do some S good SEO. You need to understand SEO. You know, you don't want to just technically slap this up here. You want to learn how to do some SEO and things of that nature, because 
doing SEO is going to help you rank higher in the search engines at the time of this recording. Search engines are still important. Um, and you want to make sure that you're getting the best bang for your buck. Okay. So then I want to take this title. I want to just paste it right here. Boom. And then I want to get a picture. I want to go back over here to chat GPT. Let me move this icon. You see guys, when I work, I have so many icons open right now. So then I'm going to do right here. And look at these vibrant thumbnails that it created for me. This is phenomenal. I like that. I like that a lot. So then I'm just going to say yoga. Okay. And then I'm going to go to the next thumbnail. I'm going to, she's got three legs. I don't know what's going on with this one. Three legs. Let's not use that one. Oh, I like that. That is freaking awesome. That is awesome. So I'm going to call that yoga. Uh, let's just call that yoga too. Yoga too. All right. And then let's see what the other one looks like. We'll take that one as well. And then I'm going to call this one yoga three. Save it. Go back over to Wix. Hit this little plus button. Hit this image button. And then what that's going to do is it's going to bring that image right here. That is going to open up the little image file. And all I got to do is just drag my image right here, just like that, from the download button, from the download icon up there at the top. And then <clears throat> I want to hit add to page as I select it. It's going to drop the image right here. Wix is going a little slow today. I'm not saying Wix is the best platform in the world. Um, yeah, I'm just saying that you can use it. You know what I mean? I'm not necessarily promoting Wix. I am promoting Southern Web Service, though. If you want you want a really good, high-quality website, you go to Southern Web Service. But if you want to do it yourself, you know, this is good, too. And then um, I'm going to take that second image, and I'm going to just drag it right here. So then you want to, once you have the, your images here, it's uploading right now. So once you have your images here, I'm feeling pumped up, by the way, pumped up, extremely pumped up. I'm feeling extremely amazing. All right. So then I'm going to just hit add to page and it's going to add that button there as well. And you get the drift. I'm going to add images to it. And then what you want to do, if your if you, if, if chat GPT didn't manually put your or automatically put your affiliate links in the article, what you could do is you can talk about your affiliate links. Let's just imagine that this was my affiliate link right here. I'll just copy the link. Of course, this is not an affiliate link, but I'm just using this as an example. And I could do multiple things. A lot of people will tell you, hey, just put it in the text. And you can. You can just hover over any of this text right here. And then you can click this little button up here that says link. And then just paste your link just like that. And then voila, now your affiliate link is in there. Boom, just like that. Also, what a lot of people fail to realize is that you can put links inside of pictures. So just click on the pictures and just put your affiliate link inside of the picture, just like that. Hit save. And then, and then now, once you save it and publish it, what you can do is you can preview it. Okay. So boom, what I'm going to do is hit this little icon and I want to... I want to look at it now. And so voila, you know, just create these really good articles. The reason why you're creating these articles is because if you create articles related to certain topics that people are searching for, people will come to your website. And when people come to your website, if you have enough of these affiliate links in here, voila, people get to clicking around. But you got to have good content. People get to clicking around, they click on something, and then all of a sudden they go to your they go to your offer that you are promoting through your affiliate link, and then voila, you got yourself something, okay? But the key here is you got to continue to be consistent and persistent. Now, a lot of people try affiliate marketing or they try blogging, and because blogging is slow, it's a slow process because you got to build up the traffic, most people give up. So 
in and of itself, that's an easy way that you can learn that you can make uh, money using chat GPT. That's one of the million ways that I just showed you today, simply by creating content, simply by blogging, simply by putting in your affiliate links. This is Robbie Cornelius with Web Asset Group. And if you want to go deeper on these subjects, go over to webassetgroup.com. This is my online community. It's an open community where entrepreneurs that want to establish, grow, and monetize their presence on the internet gather. And we have live masterminds every Thursday night and every Monday night, 8 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Go ahead and like, comment, subscribe, and ask me some questions in the comment section because I love building content off of the questions that you guys are asking. Master yourself.